What's up guys? This is the Oppo R7 and if you know anything about Oppo, you know that they have the thinnest smartphones and this one is no exception. At only 6.3 millimeters, this is the thinnest smartphone offered by Oppo and also one of the thinnest in the world. So today I want to show you guys exactly what's inside of this package so you have a better idea of just how thin this phone is and what it comes with in terms of its features. So this is the phone at only 5 inches with a 1080p screen it's probably one of the most beautiful phones offered by Oppo because of the unibody metal design now I don't know exactly how thin smartphones will eventually get but actually for this kind of thinness it feels very sturdy in your hands there's a little weight to it so you don't feel like you're gonna bend it compared to you know some other smartphones and also the screen on here is quite big compared to the rest of the ratio of the, this front facing screen here. So the Oppo is of course running the latest version of Android and Android 5.1. And uh, one of the special features about this Oppo is that it's able to do quick charging. So inside the package here, you're gonna have a couple of these uh, chargers and as you notice this cable and this charger is extra big okay and that's the reason is because a fast charging allows you to do about 10 minutes uh, will give you about two hours of talk time and 30 minutes will charge it up to 75 percent so about an hour or a little bit more than an hour you're gonna get this fully charged now the battery inside of here is running at 2300 milliamps and for me, that's about enough for a day. But if you want to do any gaming on here, you can also do that as well. So I've gone ahead and run a couple of benchmarks for you guys, so you guys can take a look at the benchmarks. Um, on Antutu, it gets about 30,000. So on Antutu, you get about 30,000. And when you run into Geekbench 3, you get a multi-score uh, about 600 and the uh, actually the single core about 600 and the multi core is about 2000 so for those of you guys who are looking for the top of the line smartphone um, this actually might not be it because it's actually limited by the size of the smartphone but what you do will, what you will get on this smartphone is a great camera and Oppo is known for their great camera lenses especially the ones where you can flip it back and flip it forward. But on this device, you get a front-facing camera that's actually 8 megapixels. So 8 megapixels is almost twice as large as what you get on the, on the iPhone. And on the back, you get a 13 megapixel. So for me, that's about enough. And I'm going to show you some sample pictures on here. And I'm going to add that into it later on. So you guys get an idea of what this camera can do at about this kind of small size. Other than that, this is running a very basic skin of Android from Oppo. So there's not much difference on here compared to what you're going to get on, you know, maybe a Nexus 5, which is running the stock Android. What I do like about this phone compared to what uh, other Oppo phones I've played with before is that they've actually tried to make this um, feel great and actually a very uniform experience and what I mean by that is at the 5 inch screen smartphone I think this is a perfect size for smartphones if you want to get any bigger what you're gonna to have to deal with is you're not going to be able to use one hand so on the iPhone 6 plus you know I have to use two hands multiple fingers to able to tap and to type but on the 5 inch smartphone it is a perfect size for you to grab it with one hand and to also text, send messages, take pictures without you know, using your hand and you can drive or you can do whatever you want with it as well. So I think the five inch is perfect for those of you guys who are looking for this form factor and comparable to this kind of build quality, you're not gonna get anything similar in its experience because I've played around with tons of phones and for this kind of price and for this kind of features, Oppo really hits it on the spot. So this is probably one of my favorite 5 inch smartphones. And if it is for you as well, go ahead and like at the bottom of our uh, YouTube here. And also to share it because we also got a giveaway going on right now. So you also want to check out that and make sure you can get a copy of this and probably win one if you're lucky. Alright, so that's it for the Oppo R7. 
and I'll check you guys back with a new smartphone next time. Thanks.